G'day everybody, welcome back to Reactive Gaming with Chris and James, and welcome back to the Sons of the Forest. We are finally going to be starting some of the building of this one. We went through uh, and finished all the wraparound here for the perimeter. We have actually just recently discovered it is not big enough for what we want to do. Hey James. No, no, it's not big enough. I said to him, I said, I said, Chris, I said, oh, Chris, 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 it's not big <laughs> enough. And he said, oh, no, it's plenty big. He it's said. plenty big, my ass, eh? We're going <laughs> to need a double, if not triple, this bad boy. Yep. At Cause least. Because what's going here takes up a bit of space. Has anyone seen the the hangars we've built in the past? We're basically going to be doing that. So the military installation needs to have hangars, barracks, towers, things like that. And this row along here is all going to be hangers. So tank hangers, plane hangers, whatever. They're going to be hangers nonetheless. So we're going to quickly walk through and show you how we do this because I'm sure people are going to want to know how we do it because they're an awesome and really, really, really easy build to do. And I think they look phenomenal. Don't you think, James? They're that e Yeah, they do look phenomenal, but they're that easy. I question how easy it is. Because something that looks this good, like these are even easier, than, easier an a -frame. than the A frame. A frames are quite complicated compared to these, and they're not that complicated. Uh, yeah. But yeah, we started it off here. What we want to do is, like you would on an A frame, this is how you would start an A frame. You have your full log, you put a quarter log on top of it, and you stretch it. That's how you're going to get this nice curvature. So, James, on that side over here, just follow me with it, okay? So we're going to go yep. five across, or six across, sorry. Hang on, I'll just get myself a, a you know what. You know what. Uh, one, two, three, four, one more. And from here, so that should be right. Pretty sure that's right, yeah. I'm going to bring this up here. We need ourselves a quarter log. Oh, what? why do I have an explosive in my hand, James? Um, yeah, uh, hang on, I'll just, um... <laughs> We're going to put a quarter on that one again. James is scared been, of my explosives. You've been told about this sort of stuff, Every you? time I touch one, <laughs> I ruined it. I ruined something. Okay, so it's, drag it all the way to this side here, please, man. Yeah, I'm just I'm making feeling... sure that you're not holding it anymore. Not holding it hostage no more. All right, from there, we're going to just put a full log that'll plop down like that. As you can see, it's starting to curve nicely there. So what we want to do after James finishes his little bit there, plop a thingy on top of that one over the other side. James? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I'll get you. Sorry. Oh. Too slow. All right, we're going to bring this over all the way. Uh, I'm not planking him yet, James. Oh. <laughs> now you tell me. Now I tell you. All righty. I, I was being spontaneous. Yeah, I can see that. That's starting to curve. So what we require now is two half logs. So I'm just going to plop these down because it's just easier. I'm going to chop these ones down to a halfy. I'm just going to steal that log for a second. We're meanwhile, gonna... jumping away. Meanwhile, James is doing something other than building. Yeah, I'm just... <laughs> I'm just joking. Calm down, James. Just calm down, mate. Just calm I was excited. Just calm down, bro. <laughs> oh, that's it. That's These it. two middle ones, we're going to chop down to three quarters. Like so. Yeah, still me another log. Look at that for, did you see that for a jump? That was a jump, mate. And then we have ourselves a beautifully rounded hanger. See that, James? That's how you do it, buddy. That's how you do it's it. It's as simple as that. It is so easy. It's too goddamn simple. Takes a little time to figure it out uh, like originally. 
The first time I did this was uh, with uh, Matt. Yeah. And um, then we tried to do a rebuild. Yeah, that didn't turn out as good as it should have. Eh? No, it it was. Yeah. Yeah, it was a bit. How you going? Why do birds oh. keep flying into me? It's like the third time that's happened. Bastards. Okay, so normally we wouldn't put these um, struts in, not struts, the um, beams in here. Yep. But we're going to be doing a overhang. Overhang. So to make this a hell of a lot easier, I'm just going to fly mode this bad boy. Oh, you, you can't be doing that. Oh, dang. That's not right. There. And we'll get rid of this um, thing James put here because I don't know why it's there. All right. So yeah, there, there, um there, there, there. Because um, James is one of those really, really advanced builders. James, one more here, please, buddy. Oh. Come on, mate. Come on. Don't have all day. Okay. Where no, are we no, going? Fully. I just need a fully over here, please. Oh, fully. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Creative mode. Love it. I'll do it myself. All good. There you go. I got it. I got it. I got it. Too late now, mate. Too late. Too late. Okay. We're going to pull out everything uh, below this. Yeah. So, oh, you know what I forgot to do? What's that? Oopsie. That's all right. I'll do it in a second. I'm just going to... Leave your scaffolding there. Because scaffolding is your friend. Take this all out. What I forgot to mention is if you want to open this up without using any debug, which I'm assuming a lot of you don't like using debug, which is fair. I don't like using it. Neither does James. Just creates oh. problems. We're going to leave this. Was that two, four, five? Beautiful. Half log there. Half log there. In between the two fives. That doesn't make sense. In between the five grids there. We want to take that out because now we can open all of this up nicely. That's yeah. huge. It's good, eh? And you can essentially make this as long as you want. And it all works on the same basis? Exactly. Just like that. Now we're going to quickly just chuck a couple of planks on here just to show you what it looks like when it's complete. This could be a really big party house, man. This could be something special. You could put a pool in here. I wonder if we could double the size of this thing. That's one big... Like 20... 20... Um... Instead of 10, uh, 10 by whatever, 20. I think it'd take a bit of working. I think you're right. I think you're right. Um, Please. now, can we do this? We'll take that. Oh, out. look at that. Hey, fills in perfectly. Oh, you know, that sucks. I hate how it does that. Oh. And now it's stuck. Let's just oh. get rid of these for a second. What's the go here? I don't know why it does that. Ah, oh, hang on. Oh, you know why it does that? Why? Uh-oh. Uh uh. You sound like me. Uh. <laughs> Because <laughs> we don't have one going across here. See where the red mark is for everyone that's watching? If I chop that down and put a... Oh, yeah. Put that there instead of a full-size log, put a three-quarter log there. That would have spanned all the way across. How can we fix this, James? We have, I know how to do it. I know how to do it. We can fix this. Because no, I want no, this filled I in. Got it, I got it, bro. I got it, bro. Okay, Check okay. this out. Go, go, go. Show me, show me. Do it. Make it happen. Uh... I will chop that down to what is that three quarter? Uh yes. A halfy? What? A halfy? Okay. We've got to lift it to be we've got to support the weight of it to be able to change that log. Because if you don't, it's just going to fall down. Yeah, okay. Well, in that case, then you're going to need to build this up to support it there. Yeah. Okay. I, I see what you're going to do. Gotcha. 
Now we've still got an overhang. Yeah, can you um, support? Br- can you bring that up for us, please? No, yep. I see what you're going to do. We actually don't so, need. We don't actually need this here. Just so you know, that I won't be, that won't be required because if you export it from there. Yep. Right, you're okay. supporting. Yeah. Yep. Just bring that up for us. I'm going to make it daytime. It's getting a bit dark. That's better. Come on. Hurry up, James. There you go. Okay. There you go. All good. Cut away. Let's take that out. Get you to and cut that to a core. Uh, do it myself. Come on. There that hurts. That hurts. That does. And then put a full cross, full one across that. Full one there. Then I need a three quarter there. And which is full. Yep. Three quarter. Yeah, you got one. Yep. Chuck it underneath that bad boy for me. There Lovely. you go. Lovely. Now we can support it all back together again. That and she will. That, that closes that back up. Yep. Cool. That's what I want It'll to see. It'll work like clockwork. Take that uh, out. Three. Chuck that back there. Take all this down. We're just going to do the same for the other side. Yep. And that closes up properly then. Right. I'll take this one. Hang on. What's that in my hand? It's a half log. Well, what's going on here now? This game really tests my patience, I tell you. It does. So that normally will just fill in as per normal. But I bet you, yeah, I because these bloody planks, I'm going to have to relay the log, I reckon. I reckon if you remove these here, it'll do it. No, no, no. It's nothing to do with that. I just put them in. Oh, okay. Shouldn't have anything to do with that, but I'll try it. So yeah, it's normally it will prompt you to go across here, it's not doing that at all. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we'll be back in a second once we figure this bit out. Such a simple solution. Thankfully, we both thought of it at the exact same time. Like, why is it not filling underneath? Everyone in the comments will be like, it's because you don't have anything underneath it. I'm like, yep, you're absolutely right. So you need to have like a support beam underneath that to be able to lay logs on the ground. So that's the front of it. Nice and easy. Not really. That took a little bit longer than I wanted to. All we got to do now is bring it all the way back to here, Mr. James. And that's yep. really, really, really easy because all we got to do is just follow follow the grid. Copy. Uh, what they call it? Copy and paste to uh, rinse and repeat. Yeah, let's go with rinse and repeat. We'll leave one um, back here so you could walk to the back of it. Okay. Yep. So essentially, this is the same way as we do the A-frame builds now. Exactly, yeah. And, yeah. And then we just plop down some mobs. Are you going half? You going the halfy or the single on the first? Yeah, okay. Like so. Yep. Okay. One... One thing that really gobsmacks me about this space is um, when you lay the, um, the planking for it on the roof, you expect it to be bubbly, blo um, like blown out. Why? Oh, just because of the, the bend in the roof, you know? Yeah, no, nah, seems but all right. No, it just seems does. Okay. It just does. I've got to get a new hand. You do? Yeah, this one ain't working. Don't work no more. You're not worky. Not worky. Once we finished all this as well, we just remove these ones. Yep. Because I'm detaching. They don't, they don't need to be there. No. If anything, it's just become, it's going to become a hindrance. Oh, bastard. And all these ones in between here could go too, because they just take up more valuable real estate. Whoa, what are you doing? Oh, you got to do it that way. That's probably the best way to do it, eh? Yep. Detach it. Yeah. So there's no chance of it getting locked. Locked like this one just did. I'm so laggy when you do that. I'm sorry. No, nah, it's not your fault. I've already locked this bastard in, so I'm going to have to fix that in a minute. 
I'll wait till you stop, otherwise I can't do anything. Yep, okay. I've got just, what, last one now. Yeah, it's just too laggy when you do it. Yeah. This game needs some serious improvements. Yeah. Oh, you know, you the know worst what? part about it is, you've got, you're the one with the, the big system. Yeah, I don't know why it always affects me. I don't understand. Actually, I usually leave these ones. Okay, the basic structure is done. It's nice and open. We decided to leave these here so we could actually walk up here and put stuff up here. Maybe, I don't know, storage shelves or something. This first yep. one here is just going to be a hanger for the tank, right? Yep. And then after that, I don't know, we probably need to make one. Oh, we'll make a few for the tanks and planes and stuff like that. Then we'll make one like a big um, munitions one. Yep, yep. One just deck it out full of... Um, oopsie. What about a motor? What about a motor pool? We don't have any vehicles. Yeah, we got um, what am I calling? Golf um, carts. Golf carts. Yeah, but they're golf carts. They're not as cool. You can take out. You can take out. What do you call them? Um, cannibals with them. Sure. Make sure you don't join any um, sections up, James. Damn, like I just did then. Da -da -da. Always the fun part. Hey, I was just thinking, you know how we were at Lynn's um, thing uh, yeah. the other day, yeah. the base? Yeah. Why don't we do some of those stairway um, panels like this? On a few of them. Oh, like a uh, skylight? Yeah, just on a couple. Like, you see where the stairs are right there where you're about to plank? Yeah. Make them more stairs. Okay. We'll just see how they look. Oh, man. Planked up the wrong thing. I'll give it a whirl. Just see how it looks. We can always tear it down if we don't like the look of it, you know? You know what we should have done with the... the um... Oh, damn. Did I just plank? Yeah, I did. Silly goose, I am. Silly, silly goose. Look at that, mate. That looks freaking awesome. Excuse me? That looks freaking awesome. What does? Just the whole curvature of the... Yeah, it does look pretty cool, eh? That looks awesome. I love it. That love looks it, love pretty it, love cool. We've got to deck it out with some lights now. Oh, we're going to use torches. <laughs> God, no. <laughs> like, normally I'll say 100%, but this is probably going to be a bit more of a modern build. Yeah, 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 and yeah. And, you know, the torches, uh, the, the light bulbs give it a bit of an industrial look as well. Because mm. that's sort of what we're going for on this build. Yep. Not going fancy, that's for sure. No, this is straight. I don't know about those stairs. I might take those stairs out, though, eh? What do you reckon? If anything, we might just put some at the back. Yeah. And piss those other ones off. What are you thinking? Okay. Yep. I just think put they it. just take up too much space. Yeah. Let's take them out. Okay. So, what my plan is... I don't know if this is going to work very well or not, but... I kind of want to do, like, power poles. Or, but light poles. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I'm hearing you. I've never actually done it before, so I'm curious to see how this is going to work or not. Uh, I need quarter logs. They're in your infantry. Oh, sorry, half log. Oh, they're not in your infantry. No, I don't, I don't get those ones. Why not? Because they don't give you half logs in your infantry. Yes, they do. No, they don't. They do. Have you been smoking again, James? I did not have... I did not have. Um, you know what? I didn't. I think I, I went a little bit overkill. That's probably too many. You know what? I might just what? make it every second one. See how that looks. That's not a light pole. What the hell is that? That's a light pole. It will be when I'm finished with it. What for a pygmy? <laughs> what the hell's a pygmy? What's Google a, that. What's a pygmy? A pygmy. I don't know what that it, means. It's an Inca, small person. 
Oh. I think it is. You know, Inca? Nah, yeah, yeah, sure. You know, back in the day. What's a back in the day? You know, the back, back then. Back when? Oh, look, you're just making this conversation <laughs> just ultra confusing. Uh, that's funny. That was, okay. That was the intention, mate. That was the intention. Oh, a pygmy is a short person. Hey, yeah. we're, we're literally just rambling now, talking shit, so we'll be back once we get a little bit more progress. Alrighty, peeps. The piece de resistance. It looks bloody awesome. It's so shiny. It's probably not a good thing for a tank in real life, but the light reflecting off it looks sick. I want to so take one of these home. You can. I can. Take one home. Go and get one. Nice and easy. Okay. So we're going to load these uh, hangers full of them. I'll probably spawn in a plane. Too bad we could only get that stupid little red plane. Yeah. What's his name? Uh, Tony Macaroni. I want a fighter jet, please. Need some fighter jets for this video. Hurry up. <laughs> snap, snap. Snap, snap. <laughs> <laughs> choppy, choppy, out of bed. <laughs> or... Or some military jeeps made from the um, from yeah. the uh, golf carts. Oh, I want some up armored Humvee or something like that. Oh, H three. Nah, H ones. Big boys. <laughs> the big yeah. boys. Yeah. Or you know the Bushmasters. Yes, I've heard about those. Yeah, the Aussie Bushmasters. They yeah, they're, yeah, they're wanted everywhere they are. Everybody wants them. I see them everywhere around here. They're usually on transport vehicles, but um, yeah, because I live like not far away from the big um, inaugural Inogra. barracks. Yeah, yeah. So we got military vehicles always passing around us all the time, and yeah. you see some cool shit. I remember um, we used to go down the highway, Bruce Highway, and um, you'd always be chasing. Tanks mm. doing 90, 80, 90 Ks. <laughs> Jesus. You know, it's just like, holy crap, man. They didn't slow down, but you could feel the bastards. <laughs> yeah, they're cool. I love them. Yeah. Anyway, that's yeah, but... the um, that's a hanger. That's one. One out of many. We got how many more to do? I don't even know. A lot. I don't know if we should just, to keep it looking sort of the same, yeah, but we'll retrofit, we'll renovate the hangar to best suit what we need to do. Uh-huh. So we'll make another couple of these, but we'll turn them into living quarters, like barracks. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, so we'll have a double level. Yep. We could use both levels, and we'll just fill them full of bunks. Yeah, we'll, true, true. A whole bunch of racks just yeah. everywhere. Yeah. I really want to put um, at the front of each barrack, like a little... Um, You're talking about like uh, a little armored dude. Yeah, a little armored dude, so he can yeah. sit there with the um. Do you know the uh, spear gun? Yeah, he could sit there and use the spear gun as his as his um fifty cal or whatever. Yeah. Look at you! You're just walking all over the tank. Yep. It's that cool. That cool. Love these tanks. These things suck. Are... Oh, you know what I should use this for? What? Clear the trees. <gasps> I can't oh, can we do that? I think we can. Hang on. How do I get in? Oh, I've got to turn my UI on. That's how. E. There we go. I reckon next episode you could, you should start off with the with the um tank taking the the trees out, just leveling the whole barracks area. I'll oh, check you. Look, it's gonna go boom in the night. I can't remember how to fire the damn thing. What's fire? Nah, that's not fire. That's escape. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have to use your um, keyboard for it? Maybe, actually. Yep, keyboard and mouse. Let's see if it takes out trees. No, but there's a nice big hole in the fence. Is there? No. Oh, <laughs> don't do that to me. 
Hang on, I gotta turn the turret downwards. Nah, it doesn't destroy trees. That sucks. Ah, uh, well, let down. That'd be so much easier to clear fields and stuff with. It sounds oh, terrible. It sounds like a. Oh, wait. Okay, which. Are you the trees are not. Yeah, they did take out the trees. Do you oh, see no. the trees moving? Are uh, they gone? Yeah? No. Yeah, yeah, I see there's a couple missing. Yeah! So, okay, it, it does take out trees. That's cool. Oh my god, he's got a toy. <laughs> this is not right. This is not right. I don't understand why it doesn't show it coming down when I hit it. Anyway. So now, you're not allowed to have grenades, not allowed to have sticky bombs, not allowed to have tanks. Can't have any fun with you, James. Oh, mate, come on. Can't have any fun. Be realistic. I was being realistic. Can't blow anything up because of you. <laughs> well, you're tired for life, mate. Oh, thanks, yeah, everybody. Well, you're welcome. Hey, V's here. I'm going to save. We're going to log yep. off. We'll see yep. everyone on the next episode. We're going to keep going on these bunkers, but the next one is probably going to be something different. Or we might actually start on the sniper towers. Not sure yet. Ooh. Don't know yet. But if we're doing an airfield with a runway, we're going to need a massive tower. Yeah. Like a control yeah. tower. Yeah. Yeah. Um, that'll pretty much be bam, spank, right in the middle, maybe. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But well, we do need to build a big tower for all that sort of stuff. So stay tuned. Well, Hopefully yeah. you enjoy the video. Thank you very much for watching. If you could please like and subscribe and leave a comment down below. So the next one. Sorry, James. I cut you off. What were you going to say? Yeah, I was going to say, for all those people out there, if you're behind me in not letting Christopher have a tank, please let me know in the uh, comments, please. Thank you. No, no, no. Don't do that. Don't put anything in the comments because then it has to be done. Yeah. So, no. See everyone. Bye. Bye.